Peterborough, day two. We didn't check the car before we put it in the trailer last night. Took the hood off. Rad fan came off. Got into the belt and uh, threw the belt off. Good way to start the day. What is it? I don't know. The paint yeah. is kind of nice. I don't have to do all the work anymore. So I have one ten mil. He's not even listening to me. No, I am. Oh, okay. Let's take this. Just got a bit of a torn belt. It's fine. Got new tires too. Oh, the sun, I don't know if you can see it. There we go. New tires go on. You're absolutely right, Jimmy, but I just kind of want to watch them struggle. Hey. You done yet? Well, we were uh, taking valve cover off to check valve lash because, you know, you got to do that every once in a while. It's a good thing we checked. That could have been bad. Caught it before it was bad. Luckily, we had the Shaws, the original builders of the motor here. They got us the tools we needed and uh, gave us a hand and got her all fixed up before anything catastrophic happened. So now we're just adjusting the valves, put the fan back on, got the new belt on. A little late for practice, but... No. No? I'm not even up to home stock when I get... Oh, never mind. We're ahead of schedule still. Mint. <laughs> Get some heat in those tires. Hot, hot, hot. Because these are brand new tires. Get some heat in them. They will not grab like your scuff tires. And then, all right, light them up. Start it up. If you're pretty sure you got the 55, you're outside. Watch your mirror and make sure you're clear to follow that 72. And you have a good chance at a really good spot, okay? Yeah. All right, good luck, buddy. Yeah. Thank <laughs> you. 
to do um try to make those a main get seventh if not better at least we, okay what are you gonna do with the corners go hard punch the gas where uh before the white line that's a good idea don't wreck it yeah i'll try not to all right cool all right good luck thank you mate yeah. the guy on the road is, is really done a feel for us so this car is a handful so he makes all sales change and he sees a rear, rear strut on the right rear of the more bike. In that Dodge Neon, we'll see if it changes the work for him here. As he tries to avoid the B main, four covers the international people are speedway pace truck in pit road. Looking for great green RV green flag with the bone stock. He raised number four off the turn number four racing with the bone stock in the stand of 23. Little slow coming up to the front of the outside lane to get the jump. Dodge jumps in the front of the 24th, and on his roof up for the head, Delta Dodge straight away, a caution flag to Delta Sickle, call that one back. Okay, the inside road jumps on that one. We'll call that one back, get a line back jump, see if someone can penalize or not. Start seeing air conditioning, caution lights, distinguish around the racetrack. We get the fire off once again. Number two on the number four, the bone stock. The stand to control car, the 23, the Cedar Road Speedway, regular. And has to try to hold off well in the 22 machine, the Flamborough Speedway, regular. Speed Snell. Both of them are going to ask Cedar Road Speedway, they start this pit road, and they have it. So the start is going to be on the inside in the air. A little better jump this time, but the other side is still a little bit quicker coming up to the gearbox. Just moving. 
Oh, there's two pairs of bombs? Huh? There's two pairs of bombs? There's two pairs of bombs. Oh no. Many. I really liked her. <laughs> oh, that hurt. Videotape, so hopefully, oh, yeah. were you videotaping? Oh,